Hello everyone. The Mokaris of Kanauj. The Mokari dynasty also known as the Mokaris of Kanauj was a post Gupta dynasty that controlled the vast plains of Ganga Yamuna for over 6 generations from their capital at Kanauj. They initially served as vassals of Guptas and later of the Harshavardhana dynasty. The Mokaris established their independence during the mid 6th century. origin and establishment the origins of mokaris as a family were rooted in antiquity but their existence as a political power of not occurred only in the 6th century ce a number of mokari inscriptions indicate that the family had many branches ruling either as chiefs or feudatories of the guptas from many parts in the north in india with the most important being at the kanya kobja political conditions in 6th century ce india The fall of the Gupta Empire led to the political disintegration of northern India. Now there arose a number of independent powers. The Kushya Bhutis, also called the Vardhana dynasty by some historians of Tanishwara, Taneshwara or Taneshwar in the present day Haryana state, the Mokaris of Kosala, Kanya Gupta, and the later Guptas of Magadha and Malwa, present day states of Bihar and Madhya Pradesh. Religion. The Mahakaris were staunch Hindus. They tried to enforce and maintain the traditional social order among the people. Hinduism received state support, but Buddhism also managed to remain as a prominent religion. Military. The Mahakari army consisted of elephants, cavalry, and infantry. The Mahakari strategy mainly focused on deploying elephant corps to crush the enemy armies. They were used against the Al. Khan Huns and the later Gupta armies notable rulers the Mahakari dynasty was ruled by several notable rulers here are some of them Hari Varman Aditya Varman Ishvara Varman Ishana Varman Sarva Varman Avanti Varman Graha Varman these rulers are known for their military prowess administrative skills and patronage of Buddhism The Mahakari dynasty played a significant role in the history of India. Their rule marked a period of political transition in northern India and their military and religious policies had a lasting impact on the region. Despite their eventual decline, the Mahakari's legacy continues to be a subject of historical interest. Thank you. Bye.